hey loves and welcome back to the channel guys so in today's video i'm going to be getting on ready with you and also showing you guys my nighttime skincare routine basically how i take off my makeup and i start off first by taking off my false lashes and i love to do this because these lashes are reusable and i like to make sure that i'm taking them off gently and also safe keeping them at the same time i first of all go in with a cleansing oil and this one is from the brand revolutions i love using cleansing oils to break down my makeup and all the products that i must have applied i'm using this very generously so that way it is easy to glide on it is also easy to break down all the products and also melt down all the products at the same time now i'm applying this and i'm massaging this and i'm also kind of rubbing this around every area that i applied makeup on so i'm focusing this on like my under eye i'm being very gentle with this my eyelids as well to take off my eye products as well as my mascara and my eyeliner my forehead as well as my hairline because sometimes we forget that area now i'm going in with my baby wipes this is what i use for my baby now because my baby has a sensitive skin these products are amazing for using on the face i either go with huggies or water wipes that have 99% of water now I use this to cleanse my face I use it to take out all the makeup that we just broke down using the cleansing oil I never forget my lips guys I always take up my lips especially when you apply lipstick my neck as well and I'm being very gentle with this and this is what we look like after just cleansing once now next up I'm going ahead to use a makeup remover I'm using this because this helps in breaking down tough makeup products like mascaras eyeliner you know eye pencil whatever product might be tough to take off this is amazing for it and I'm just wetting it on a cutting pad and applying this on my eyelids for at least a couple of seconds and then swiping it downward so that way we can take out the mascara take out the eye liner or whatever residue or whatever product remains on the eyes and I'm doing this very gently but I'm also doing it very thoroughly so that way we can get rid of any residue again I always love to double cleanse guys I love to cleanse my face with an oil at least twice so that way whatever products we weren't able to melt down and take down the first time we can do it now now i'm just massaging this cleansing oil all over my face just to kind of hydrate it to loosen it up to get it ready for washing and by doing that it's easier to apply on any other product or cleansing wash or whatever it is you're going to be using next right and i saturate this all over my face again because i want to also melt down whatever products i still have on i'm going to be using this ultra gentle daily cleanser by neutrogena guys and i love this because it is so easy to work with it is it's amazing for sensitive skin it leaves my skin feeling amazing after using and i like to go in with two pumps because i feel like two pumps is just the perfect amount of product to use and i like to first of all because i cleanse or i wash my face twice the first time i like to go in with the product without applying water so that way i can massage the product in without it you know getting all you know wet and droopy and having the product all over the place now i'm just focusing the product itself on my face and i'm massaging this generously on my face but also trying as much as possible to you know cleanse it rub it so that way the makeup loosens up at the same time so i'm going ahead to rinse it and while i'm rinsing it as well i'm also rubbing this gently so we can get off and rinse off all the excess makeup products like i said guys i love double cleansing i love doing it twice so i'm going ahead to use the same cleansing um wash on my face and i'm just doing this now that my face is now wet you guys can see that you know it's a lot soapy now and i feel like when you apply water to your face and um, it just becomes messy so that's why i don't like applying water to my face the first time and i'm going ahead to rinse it because again we did most of the work the first time and this is what we are looking like we are pretty much clean so the next thing I like to do is to use my Kojic wash um, I love to use my Kojic sponge and I want to I'm going ahead to dampen this up I'm going to run this underneath the water so that way it becomes soft 
and flexible so I'm going in with this um, smoothing scrub by St. Ives and I'm applying this generously on my Kojic sponge and I'm going to be using this on my face you can use this as a mask or you can use this as a scrub but because I applied makeup today and because I apply I feel like I applied a lot of makeup today I'm going to be using this I don't typically use this on a daily basis but, and I'm rinsing this off next up I'm going in with my cotton pad and I'm going to be using my toner and this one is the one I'm going to be using this is from Dr. Tills and this one has witch hazel as well as rose water two of the amazing you know products that I like right it's gentle but it's also very effective I'm going to be using this to cleanse my face but also tone my face well, I'm applying this onto my face, but I'm also using this cotton pad to cleanse my face at the same time. And I'm just using this on the areas that I feel like might have you know, leftover product on my neck, on my face. I'm applying this product generously and <laughs> intentionally, guys. So my hairline as well, and I'm going to show you guys what we have on the cotton swab you guys can see that it's pretty clean and um, we don't have any makeup products anymore because we have cleansed this face properly but now i'm going in with my on with with this on my hairline because sometimes i feel like we don't get as much product off on our hairline again i'm going across my hairline and i'm going to be showing you guys what we got off the hairline again do not forget this area, um, especially if you're wearing wigs. You don't want to have build ups and clogs and then breakouts in that area. This is what we have. Um, it's not a lot, but it's definitely something. And now I'm just taking that out. So, next off, I'm going to go ahead to use my essence. And this one is from Coshrax, right? I'm going to be using the Advanced Snail Essence. I'm going to be applying this generously on my face. I always go in with two palms with whatever. Um, skincare products I'm using. I don't know why. I just feel like it's just the right amount And I'm applying this generously on my face and also on my neck as well and I'm massaging this in and This is what we are looking like so far Next up I'm going in with my vitamin C and I'm applying this on to my skin this one is amazing as well because I want this to be very effective because again it's night time and I'm going to be sleeping all through. This is the best time to use skincare products guys because they are most effective at this time. So I want this to help brighten as well as even out my skin but also make my skin healthy and glow at the same time. I'm going in with my moisturizer um, this one is um, I'm, I'm in love with it it's from Yves Rocher and I do have a dry skin so this one keeps my skin hydrated it gives off like that glassy skin look and it doesn't look greasy or oily it just looks healthy and it feels healthy at the same time so I definitely love this product and how it makes my skin feel so I'm going in with my eye cream this one again is from revolutions I'm just applying this underneath my eyes as well as on my lids as well and I'm being very gentle with this right so yeah I'm just making sure that my entire face is properly hydrated and saturated with skin goodness So lastly, I'm going in with my Vaseline, guys. This is so basic, but also so effective. I don't know why I'm just falling in love with it. I love how it looks. I love how it feels. And I'm using this all over my lips, just saturating this product on my lips. And guys, this is what we're looking like. I know we look like a grease ball, but this is like a healthy grease. It is not greasy. It is just hydrated. I promise you, guys, that last moisturizer we applied is what is making me glow to be honest with you and the first day i used it i never i've never turned back and it's absolutely amazing so yeah this is the end of this video i hope you guys enjoyed this takedown getting ready with me and this is what we are looking like right now and um, we're clean we're hydrated we're ready 
and yeah this is it i'll see you guys in the next one make sure you give me a thumbs up like share comment and i'll see you in the next one till then stay fabulous and stay blessed bye